so welcome to Passe. Um, as you'll probably see in the net here, Darren has just caught uh, one of our big sturgeon. He's given him the fight of his life. He's jumped several times. It's taken about 20 minutes to bring in, so he's knackered. Okay, so you have to be very, very careful uh, with all sturgeon, actually, in terms of how you release them back. So we've weighed it, we've photographed it, we've kept him wet. We're just about to put him back in the water. Now, you know, normally with a carp, you might just give it a few seconds. With the sturgeon, you have to be a bit more particular, so we're going to show you now. So as we put him back in the water, you want to make sure that you uh, keep him in the sling. The sling is a flotation sling, so you shouldn't have any troubles. So this could take, you know, one minute, it could take ten. It depends on the kind of fight that you've had. You know, they'll jump, they'll tug forever, so uh, you need to give him, uh, give him the respect when you're releasing him. He's releasing all the air uh, in his blood from the fight uh, um, a minute ago, which is a good sign. You know, you want to release that. And then Darren, what Darren's going to start to do is just rock him back and forth to start getting some oxygen going through his gills. Now, after two or three minutes, what you'll find is the sturgeon will try and kick away. And it's best to try and hold him on that first kick. You know, you want him going back as strong as possible. So you keep rocking him back and forth, hold him on the first kick and on the second or third kick when he's really fighting to go, then you can simply gently let him go. But for now, as you can see, he's knackered. He's releasing air from his bloodstream and Darren needs to support him and keep getting that oxygen into him. And you know, that's what a big sturgeon is going to do. So we'll just watch this for a minute until, uh, until the sturgeon is good to go. Good take. So this sturgeon is starting to uh, to get his energy back now. He's starting to kick down and he's starting to fight. He's starting to want to go. This is probably like the second or third time now that he wants to go. So I think we'll probably let him go once we get a strong kick. There we go, there he is. Okay, so that is how you release a sturgeon at Moulin de Passe. <laughs>